When students learn about fractions, they often think that they're encountering some completely new beast. And uh, they learn how to add fractions, multiply fractions, or maybe they don't learn that. But it's as if there's nothing to do, no connection between fractions and whole numbers. In the standards, fractions uh, are introduced in a way that shows that uh, unity of the number system. Whole numbers, kids learn about whole numbers uh, just originally just by counting one, two, three, four, then they learn to add them, three plus four is seven, then they learn to multiply them. When we come to fractions in grade three, you're just introducing a new unit. So instead of counting by ones, you're counting by fifths. You divide the unit interval into fifths, and you have one fifth, two fifths, three fifths, four fifths. Then you learn to add those three fifths plus four fifths is seven fifths. In other words, fractions are really just uh, an extension of the number system. And we uh, link the work with fractions, adding them initially, adding and subtracting, and then multiplying fractions, dividing fractions. We continually link that work back to understandings of addition and multiplication that were developed in the work with whole numbers. So for example, addition is just putting things together, putting lengths together, whether they're fractions or whole numbers. The, ca the way you calculate the sum of two numbers might look very different, the computation looks different, but the operation is the same.